is if you know who dara Gizel is warn her she should stop this torment i don't like it it's not a joke anymore <laughs> Yeah, so I'm off to the tailors to drop off my burial clothes. She was kind enough to say she was gonna do everything for free. So afterwards, I was craving suya, and I found this very um, this spot they sell ram suya. Mm -hmm. This is the first time I'm taking ram suya in a worry and I decided to take it. It's behind Concord Hotel, just on that same um, avenue, just down the street a bit. I had it, but I'll just give the ram suya a six over ten. Or even a five the hype was just not for me it didn't even make sense i beg so you see it now thank you five hundred no one go with you if you say you don't bring one dollar you don't try it. hey for this country where your brother they rule us road and i know it's bad manners but i'm hungry so i'm just gonna try it out actually see what it looks like I'm just gonna grab one. Ooh, ooh. Hmm. So I got the ram on the cows here. So Derek Zell has been tormenting me with mangoes. Like I just finished watching her video now and it was mango full. So I'm about to go have mangoes now. I like. I'm gonna have this now. See how they look like now. Hmm? Very yellowish something. Okay. Now burial prep proper. So my aunties went to um, a bar and bought all this. The materials here are for relatives and friends who want to show ashebi. Yes, for burials they also do ashebi in eastern nigeria if you want so here is a segment where i already allotted those for my relatives the ones for relatives can be um they were shared to them free they didn't have to pay anything but for friends you had to buy right so this is where i had um itemized each family and then shared or allotted a piece of material to them the accordingly now. like shared the it according to them like according to their number and everything and so um oh, no. i don't know if you can hear me very well because of the sound but yeah i'm just gonna show you what it looks like this was actually part of the souvenirs that we bought for the burial so those people were kind of um putting the sticker on it i don't know how they do that thing then it stays on it permanently you can't go out like it's watermarked and everything so um each we had different designs and different um shapes and patterns for each and every one of them these were part of it the other ones have been done and packed we also had um this type i loved this sieve as well so i kept some for the house you had like a lot these were the shirts they were making for people to wear that morning when we bring her from the mortuary then there were umbrellas as well for um part of the souvenirs there were a variety of things um to be bought to be shared like i said do not stick to one thing especially if you're working with a budget try to like have a variety so just of take things it, like we it see the spice of life so we yeah, try to incorporate a lot of things into this this was the souvenir for the general public and um yeah we had a lot of other souvenirs from my relatives her cousins did a lot of souvenirs for her pay um jotters towels bags i'll show you at the end of this video um this whole process just made me understand that family truly is everything so i'm grateful to everyone so this is them actually doing their whole um thing at the back like yeah so all these things you see and everything this is how it's done nigeria has a lot of talent nigeria has a lot of ah nigeria sha it go well it go well dollar now is at 500 naira to a dollar so you can imagine that things are actually on the rise things are actually expensive what you could get for 100 naira before you're getting for 200 or 300 naira a few minutes to show you the level of progress and um, i'm supposed to go meet the girl who's meant to make my fascinator to also have some other types of souvenirs coming from um, innocent 
yeah innocent plastics um they are currently making some as well um for um they're also currently making some and they'll be able to deliver it soon um my dad and my brother just um stepped out to do something so i'm home um i don't know for those who've been asking we're three we're three sha my sister my brother and me so we're just three lovely beautiful children from this amazing woman i miss her so much but i'm so proud to have been her daughter i'm so proud she was my mother forever like you see how pretty my mom is like like excuse you excuse you 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 <laughs> my mom was literally the most beautiful woman and you know she used to re tell me that time that i remind her so much of her youthful years like like I, whenever she sees me she will just remember when she was so much younger god's will we can't question god blah 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 even if i question him from today to tomorrow it's not going to bring her back so i'm just going to leave with the sweet memories of her her good name her legacy what she imbibed in me what i learned from her i'm just going to enjoy the memories of everything and that's all that truly matters because in the end death for every man is inevitable it doesn't matter when it doesn't matter how it's just the only certainty that we're sure of but all that really matters is how well you lived and mama lived a very beautiful life good woman amazing person Ochora, my mama i love her so for all you who still have mamas better take care of your moms okay So the trays from Innocent finally came. This is what it looks like. It's um, a tray. It's actually very beautiful and I loved it. So yeah, this is what it looked like. And it was really um, affordable. It was really affordable. It was okay. Really nice. That's for her. It's a very short wearing bag from her cousins. Different colors. Different colors. From her cousins as well, like towels, a lot of them. They had books as well. I mean, we had a lot. There were even some that I didn't take note of that were shared at the burial ground um, from her relatives as well, from different people, different people made souvenirs and everything. It was just amazing. But you know, we give thanks to God and yeah. Before this video ends, I just thought to say something. With all this going on in the world, all this happening, all the recent happenings, everything, what would you be remembered for when you leave here? Are you living your life to please other people? Are you just happy with yourself? This is just a message to everyone who is having a hard time. Take it easy on yourself, be happy, and understand that always do you. Do right by God, do right by you, and understand that the world will adjust. I hope you always find time to be at peace with yourself and be happy with yourself and also forgive yourself. You are worth every moment of happiness, and I pray you realize that soon. Love you and see you in my next video. And no, I'm not quarreling with Dara Gizel as, you, as you've seen from the, this video. If you watch this very point, thank you so much.